Hi guys, welcome to Keep It Chill. I'm going to show you five really simple vodka cocktails today. So let's start. Uh, the first uh, drink I'm going to be making is Moscow Mule. Uh, Moscow Mule is served in a copper glass and uh, the drink will be made directly in the copper glass. So I'm just going to be putting like half a lime in this. I'm going to be squeezing like fresh lime. Put two ounces of or 60 mils of vodka. I'm using Sky Vodka today. And four ounces of ginger beer. Just make sure that the ice is filled up to the top of the glass and just stir. And then I'm just going to be putting some fresh mint on the top for garnish. Some fresh mint, wheel of lime. Thank you. The next drink is the vodka martini. So I'm going to be uh, using the shaker for this. Um, two ounces of vodka or 60 mils of vodka. Again, I'm using Sky Vodka for this. You can make this drink with gin also. I actually prefer gin martini, but you can also use, some people actually prefer vodka martini. So two ounces of vodka, half ounce or 15 mils of dry vermouth. Now, some people stir the drink but I prefer this to be shaken and I'm gonna just chill my glass a little bit I'm gonna put in a little bit of ice in the glass so that the glass can be chilled and just Shake the shrimp a little bit. You don't have to shake too much, just a little bit. And glass is chilled. I'm going to take the ice out. And it's ready to be poured. Really nice and simple drink. Just garnish with a couple of martini olives. And you just put a peel of lemon for garnish. You just take a thick peel of lemon. And you can squeeze the peel a little bit gently over the top of the martini to get the oils on the martini. Just rub it a little bit on the rim of the glass. And there you go. Thank you. The next drink is the Caprioska. Uh, it's a really simple drink. Um, I'm just going to be cutting half a lime here into small wedges. Just put 
the lime wedges in a shaker. Take one ounce of simple syrup. If you don't have a simple syrup, you can just use a sugar and water solution. And you can take like 50% sugar, 50% water, which is really easy to make. Just muddle it a little bit. Two ounces of your favorite vodka or 60 mils. And put a lot of ice in the shaker. And that's it. And you don't have to strain this strain. Just put the whole thing into a glass. With, along with the ice and the lemon like this. There you go. That's your caprioska. I will again garnish with a wheel of lime. There you go. Just gonna put a cocktail straw in that. Thank you. The next drink is a kamikaze. Uh, it's a really simple drink. Uh, I'm gonna be making it in a coupe glass. So I'm just gonna chill the glass with a little bit of fresh ice. And while I'm making the drink, the glass can be chilled. For this, equal parts of vodka, lime juice, and triple sec. So one and a half ounce of your favorite vodka. One and a half ounce of triple sec. Squeeze half a lime in that. Put a lot of ice in the shaker. and give it a good shake. I'll take the ice out. You can see that the glass is chilled. Just strain the bank in the glass. Garnish with a bead of wine. There you go. Thank you. The next thing I'll show is the sea breeze. Uh, so for this, I'm using grapefruit, uh, fresh grapefruit. Make sure you use fresh grapefruit just to take the juice out. I am I need like two ounces of grapefruit juice. Just squeezing it. In the shaker, just take two ounces of grapefruit juice. 
Grapefruit juice is good for cocktails since it has a little bit of citrus and a bitter flavor, which is great for drinks. Uh, again, two ounces of your favorite vodka. And three ounces of cranberry juice. Put a lot of ice. And give it a good shake. Drink is ready to be strained in the glass. Chop it off. And I will just take a peel of the bay fruit. Just take, take a thick peel. Squeeze it up the top. Just gosh. There you go. As always, thanks a lot for uh, watching my videos. If you like the train, please like and subscribe my channel down below. And um, if you have any other ideas about the drinks, if you want a little bit of variations of these drinks, always write it in comments and um, just let me know which one did you like the best. Thank you.